So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to the link, which will be down below in the description. We're gonna scroll down, and now you're gonna download this one right here. Download Windows drivers, or if you're using Linux, you can go with this one. So you want to use this one instead of the other thing that you're probably using. If this does not apply to you, you can just skip over to the second method. I'm using Windows, so I'm just gonna be going with this one. Click on download. Wait for this to download. And then once it's been downloaded, we're gonna click on it to install it. And then click on yes. And then click on install. I don't have an AMD system, so for me, I cannot proceed. But in your case, you should now be able to download your drivers through the software. And now for the second method, you wanna head over to search and type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you're gonna type in NETSH space Winsock space reset. Click on enter. And now you're gonna type in ipconfig space forward slash release. Click on enter. And now you're gonna type in ipconfig space forward slash renew. Click on enter again. Wait for this to load. And now you're gonna type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. Click on enter again. And now you just wanna restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed. 